percent. Folks, it's... It is... I gotta tell you, it is so great doing shows in front of a live audience on Broadway again. You can feel it. You can feel it. New York City is back. But long-time viewers... Long-time viewers of The Late Show know that there are other cities in America than New York. <laughs> and I hope they're back, too, because I love the small towns of America. And that's why we have a segment called Community Calendar, where a guest and I talk about actual events that are actually happening in that guest's actual small hometown. We're talking places like Plainfield, Illinois, or Stillwater, Oklahoma, or... Did somebody say Chesterton, Indiana? <laughs> Jim Gaffigan. How are you? Jim Gaffigan. Yeah, very nice. Jim Gaffigan. Are you telling me? Are you here to tell me that you're from Chesterton, Indiana? I am. I mean, can you believe the coincidence? <laughs> I'm from Chesterton, Indiana. It's more than a coincidence, what? Jim. It's a happy accident because it's time for Chesterton, Indiana's community calendar. <laughs> Welcome to Community Calendar, your source for what's happening in and around Chesterton, Indiana, and the greater Duneland area. <laughs> Joining me is native Chestertonian Jim Gaffigan. Welcome, Jim. Thank you, Stephen. You know what we say in Chesterton? It's a Chester ton of fun. <laughs> so true. Now, <laughs> let's get to some actual upcoming events going on in and around Chesterton. That's right. This Wednesday, head to nearby Porter Lakefront Pavilion for sunset yoga. <laughs> Pro tip, if you don't look good in yoga pants, show up late. It'll be dark. <laughs> From now through Sunday at the Memorial Opera House, it's the closing weekend for Clue, the musical. <laughs> It'll be followed by Risk, the musical, which lasts 12 straight hours and ends when the cast gets sick of it and everyone stops playing. <laughs> On July 25th at the Porter County Fair, which, by the way, I went to, and it's an amazing <laughs> fair. But on the 25th, it's the Night of Destruction. <laughs> That's right. A demolition derby for cars, trucks, and vans, and as well, kid power wheels. <laughs> so come on, smash them up if you got a spare car or a spare kid. That's white rage. <laughs> Every Saturday this summer, it's Chesterton's famous European market, featuring over 80 vendors from Indiana, Michigan, <laughs> and Illinois. So stop by for a taste of Europe, all the way from Milan, Illinois, <laughs> Paris, Michigan, and French Lick, Indiana. Jim. Jim, you're a native. Why do they call it French Lick? Well, you know, some people think it refers to the early French settlers uh, who discovered nearby salt licks. But, you know, I think it's... I think it's about two horny settlers... <laughs> Tonguing down on each other. <laughs> That's how we do it Indiana style. <laughs> Here's a fun one. On July 15th, head to the Indiana Dunes. By the way, I set an entire dune on fire when I was 15. <laughs> but head to the Dunes State Park for the beach prom family friendly improv comedy on the beach. Perfect for anyone who's been at the, uh, an improv show and thought, this is great, but I could also use some sand in my ass crap. <laughs> Next Thursday at Anderson's Winery and Vineyards, it's speed networking after hours, which will take place at the late, late hour of... 4 p.m. <laughs> so stop by to make vital business contacts 
with go-getters who leave work and start drinking early. <laughs> On July 29th, head to Chesterton's Amphitheater for a music series called Coffee and a Concert. Originally titled, You're Gonna Have to Poop in the Middle of a Concert. <laughs> of course, this Sunday is the 4th of July, so head over to the Hobart Lakefront Fireworks featuring live music from the band Chronic Flannel. <laughs> Named for the two things Willie Nelson always has on him. <laughs> Next Friday in Michigan City, Indiana, book your ticket uh, for a combination boat tour and bachelorette party called The Cruise Before the I Do's, <laughs> which will include a special appearance by the men of Michigan City strippers? That can't be. Is that... Oh, yeah. The, uh, by the way, the, all right, the, that's right. The male strippers from Indiana that are somehow not called Who's Your Daddy? <laughs> Steven, you know, that's how I paid for myself for college, and that's actually, stripping was my major in college. Really? <laughs> really? Oh, yeah, and ha uh... <laughs> Go on, Jim. Is, I even there, is there more to this story, I Jim? think there might be. I even had a special move, and it was called the French Lick. <laughs> Well, that does it for Chester and Indiana's community calendar. As we like to say in Indiana, I'd rather, I'd always rather be Indiana than out Deanna. <laughs> Stick around, I'll be back with Jim Gaffigan. <laughs>